Hey there. Um, we're picking up um, snail mail here. Uh, audio is a little messed up. There. Um, I feel like we're getting close to the end. We've been doing this for quite a while. A few episodes, and we're right. Well, we're right around here. I think. I can't tell. Great way to start. <coughs> um, I forgot this game is actually hard. Sometimes. Doing good, doing good. I'm about, you know, third the way there. Oh, jinx myself. Oh, come on. Exactly what he said. Not cool. The snail guy is really the best character ever. He's so cool. I wish I was that cool. I don't know. I'm probably probably a bit cooler than, than him, but I'm a trailblazer. Uh, so basically some of those jumps are basically mines because if you hit you hit one of those jumps one of the later ones you're just dead so I was like who cares what were we talking about I have no idea um oh yeah yep that Oh, um, there was a game I wanted to tell you guys about. Um, this is making me a little motion sick. Not really, it's just it's weird because as you go to one side, um, it kind of like swivels the level. Very strange. Um, so yeah, the game. Really games. Um, I'm sure all of you have heard of. Sure, um. Alright, most of you have heard of Rayman. Um. But there are some excellent, um. Rayman games that have come out in the past few years. So these, these particular ones are 2D platformers. Um not even really an action platformer just more of a regular platformer which I like I don't play as many action platformers as I do regular platformers um, I don't know why, maybe it's because I've just you know, Mario is just so great uh, still good it's about halfway through um, so yeah, the Rayman games I'm talking about, they came out recently, and um, they're for everything. Um, I'm, I'm talking specifically about darn, two of them, um, Rayman Origins and Rayman Legends. Um, I'm trying to think what makes them so great. They're like... Um, they're absolutely beautiful. 
to start off with that. Beautiful, beautiful games. Um, it's got this really nice um, cartoony style with like background paintings. Um, and the paintings are always great. Um, it's got really funny bosses. It's got um, amazing music. Um, and of course the platforming and gameplay is very good. Um, see, I don't know why it's so underground. Like, why why everyone isn't talking about them because they're like the best games really really they are so check out Rayman Origins for the 360 the PS3 I wouldn't get the Wii or the 3DS versions for obvious reasons um, the resolution is going to be lower and these games are so beautiful that you really want a high resolution almost at the end here Oh boy. No. No, 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 no. So, um, Origins is for those four platforms, I believe. And Legends is for the Switch, the PS4, the Xbox One. I think both are for Windows, too. Um, really really cool game games if you had to choose one to start with I guess I'd go with legends I feel like they perfected it a little bit um, Um, I'm excited for um, the next Can It Mario. Um, right now I'm working on Virtual Garage episodes, which I think we talked about on the show here. Um, I've been working on Virtual Garages recently just because it was time. Um, you know, a lot of people have preferred virtual garage and a lot of people that I've talked to have preferred um Can It Mario. I like them about equal. Um I think I like Can It Mario just a little bit more. But I also realize that Virtual Garage is so great. Even maybe it comes out maybe even a little bit better somehow. Um and that's because I write the music, and I, um, I spent a lot of time getting the shots and doing all that stuff. Um, but yeah, I'm excited to get the back to Can It Mario when I'm done with this. I'm going to be, um, I read that, oh, come on, I was so close to um, one thing I want to change is I want to, instead of having, you know, one source of light, or two sources maybe, the, the light I use, and then the overhead light, um, I'm really supposed to have, like, three sources of light. Um, I don't think that counts the overhead light, so I think, you know, I'm very excited to, um, that's some loud wind out there, um, excited to do that, I, uh, it's really fun for me, shooting.
shooting the controllers and being, you know, creative like that. And I think it's going to come out really good next next time around. I mean, it always comes out good, so. That's exciting. Oh, come on. Now, I didn't even check the time when we started. I assume it's been ten minutes. Um, okay, we'll go with that. Um. So I think the levels in this game are a bit too long. I think that's one problem. Well, that's okay. I don't want to hit any of those at the end. It's no good. Like, why am I going so fast? I never go this fast. Oh, remember but, uh, when I first started and I just... I was going crazy. I couldn't take the pressure of all those guys. I just kept going as far left and right. Just, Of course I was going to mess up. That was really funny, actually. I had to stop myself from swearing, like, at least thrice. Three times, that means. Can you guys hear this music? It is very strange. Fits though. I'm gonna be quiet for a minute. This isn't even a hard level, I it just. It's too long. And I'm going way too darn fast. Ugh! Oh, I hate that spot. I, I definitely would have beaten it already if it wasn't for that. Um. I like this game, but it isn't always fair. I don't love this game. I like the game. Would I recommend you play this game? Um, would I recommend you play it? Maybe not, but maybe. It's very hard to take seriously. I'll give it that much. It's cool. I'm enjoying my time, and I know it's making for good... Um, good internet, good television. Got some good internet. Oh, come on. I know I can beat this. I just, it's the same. It's always the same spots that get me.
Let me try silence again. Maybe that'll work. Hate that part. And there's multiple of them, so very likely to hit the same things. That part's hard. Too much happens at once. No, no, no. Whew. I just need to get a little farther. Keep it together. Come on. So, they they require you get there very quickly. Um... Or else they that are too much damage, and then you speed up. So that oh, come on. I guess that one was my fault, but it's wearing me down a little. quiet for a minute. This is a tough one. Come on, don't do it. Am I gonna make it? What? What? Um, yeah. That is no good. How do they expect me to get through that? Oh, I thought it was this side. Well, how do they expect you to do that? That is... So unfair? That's ridiculous. Like, why would they do that? Why would they put that many in a row? I th I, they've done this before, too. Like... The thing about this game is it... It's fun because you've never played anything like it, and you'll probably never play anything like it again. It's just very strange. Um, which, you know, I'm very excited to play it every time um, we, I start recording. But then there's, then there's things like that. Just like almost a dozen of them in a row. Why would they do that? Why do they keep doing that? It makes no sense. Like, I can get through it, but that's only because I have to do it, I have to do it, like, ten times in a row. And then, at the end, I eventually do. Okay, good. This is what I want. Rapid fire. Stay in the middle as much as I can, so that I can get to that group of them. Ooh. 
least I'm getting better. See? I was there, I was shooting as quickly as possible. Um, just down the middle. Down the middle. Didn't, wasn't enough. Um, this game's making me angry, actually. It's moments like those that make me, <coughs> excuse me, make me, um, not recommend this game. I'm gonna beat it. I can tell. But not 100% sure I'm gonna come back to it. It's a cool little fever dream. I mean, it's cool. It looks really neat sometimes. You just kind of look at it, like, right now. Very colorful. It's like I have to get more ammo. Somehow. But if I get too much ammo, they're homing. So maybe this is perfect. Keep it down the middle. Keep it down the middle. Maybe I can avoid a couple of them if I have to. I hate this game right now. Um... It really sucks too because um, I'm going to have to um, I'm going to have to call it and then I'm going to have to beat this. Hopefully soon after I try to beat it on my own, I'll beat it. But this game's done that a lot, and you know, I'll play through the pain, but I'm not particularly happy. <coughs> particularly happy about it. Let's put it this way, most YouTubers, or most Twitch players, or, you know, I don't think they'd put up with this. But I think now would be about the moment where they're like, yeah, I've had enough. I'm starting to feel that way for sure. You know, you gotta... That's the thing, you've got to... One more try, and I'll beat this on my own. Um, you have to... You gotta, like... I don't know. Snail Mail, as a Let's Play, has definitely been my best. So it's like... I feel a little obligated to keep playing. Not that I don't like it. It's just... Every time I pick up the game, there is one of these where I have to come back. Or we have to come back after... I beat it. Like, I don't want this item. This item's terrible. It's slower, I think. And it homes in, so it's going to it's going to screw me up for sure. There we go. That's what I want. Now we're good, maybe. I'd like it if I kept this item. Maybe if I can keep this yellow thing just a bit longer I can just blow through it 
See, I get, I get so close. Now, hopefully I have this red thing. Finally! I'm glad you guys were able to see that. Wow, that was, that was rough. Okay, um, I'm going now. When we get back, more snow mail. I will not let the, win the game win. I will win. I will win. Alright, bye now.